Subscribe, hit that bell icon and share this clip if you enjoy it. This is TRS Clips. I think there's a big distinction between what's happening in the OTT space and what will eventually happen in cinemas. Break this down. Yeah. So we're in a transitional phase right now because the lockdown happened, theaters shut down. So suddenly OTT platforms picked up and everybody said, okay, we cannot release over here. Now, because there's been that huge influx, now is when the audiences will start settling and decide what they want to watch because mm. the ease of choice is a lot more on a digital streaming platform because here, man, it's on my phone. <laughs> I don't have to. Um, I don't have to go to the cinema. I don't have to get out of my home. I don't have to commute, bear the traffic, buy a ticket, find my parking, buy the concessions, find my seat. Somebody else is sitting there. Move them. So it's it is a process when you go to the theaters. Mm. When you go to the theaters, it's about an experience of watching a film. Mm. Gotcha. OTT isn't about the experience of watching a film. It's about watching the film. Hence, because of that, and the only focus is on the film, your focus is purely on content. And your mm. content has to be excellent. If it's not, pause button, gone. You're never coming back to it. If I'm in the movie, I'm not liking the movie, I'm like, ah, forget it, I'm bored, but I'll sit here for three years. I bought the ticket, might as well sit in the AC. You're not going to get up and leave. Mm. Right, so you have that. So now it's going to start settling. There are going to be, I mean, the, I, I predict there'll be a time where different digital platforms will have different kinds of audiences. Hmm. You know, your Hotstars, your Netflix, your Amazons, your uh, Sony Live, your Z5s are all going to have different profiles of, of, of audiences that patronize it. Everybody uh, is not going to want to pay the subscription for all of them. So they will decide ki zyada tar jo mujhe acha lagta hai wo kis platform pe main wo dekhunga mm. that in itself will divide the audience so mm. like what happened uh, you know in in theaters there was the 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 single screens and the multiplexes where the multiplexes were perceived to be the the more discerning audience they they you can show a different kind of film because there were smaller theaters you didn't have to spell set, uh, sell so many tickets so you know those medium to small budget films could also be made and end up doing well mm. A similar thing I predict is going to happen on OTT. So they're going to they're going to patronize content which has to be very engaging. Yeah, yeah. And I feel in time to come, not immediately, in time to come, you want to go to the theater to see those larger than life films because you want the physically large screen mm. and you want the experience of watching the film. Yeah. So there'll be content where which is experience based. Hundred percent. I'm dying to go see Suryavanshi in the theaters and whistle and clap and throw money and <laughs> dance. Yeah. I'm not just going to see my friend um, Akshay and Ajay and Ranveer and Katrina and Rohit's film. I'm going to experience it as well. And Rohit has the brilliance to understand that. So he makes his films in that way. Mm. It's all there to entice you into that experience. Yeah.